Hi everyone, this is Jamie Sorensen here at Two Peas in a Bucket with a 5 under 5 video where we share 5 of our favorites under 5 minutes. I'm going to start out showing you the Artisan Chipboard and Elements from Pink Paisley. Um, these are the Heidi Swap Chipboard and these are great because they have these awesome black and white text pattern on them but then they um, that are great just to be left alone or you can customize the customize these with um, your different inks and paints, mists, um, any of those mediums that you like to play with. And then the there's a subtle texture on these. Um, this one has a grid pattern where it will resist your mediums and have um, another layer of pattern on them. And so this, these are the arrows and they come in all different shapes and sizes. We also have stars that have a polka dot resist pattern. I love these for Christmas. The hearts have a chevron resist pattern. And then the butterflies have a pretty diagonal stripe. So these are the artisan chipboard pieces from Heidi Swap for Pink Paisley. And then there's also the artisan elements. And these are um, kind of a foamy texture. I'm not sure what material this is, but it's um, a kind of plastic that um, is kind of spongy. And these are the borders. There's 12 pieces here and there there are all kinds of different resist patterns included in these. So we get polka dots, chevrons, script. Um, I love this arrow stripped here. These are squares and so there's all different, there's 16 different pieces here and these would make a lovely um, album cover or just a, a frame for your different square photos. These are the circles. And then there are a few different word versions. Um, this one is called Cherish. It says love, sweet, forever, and cherish with different hearts and keys. This one is travel. This one has arrows and stars. And this one is family and it has um, different family icons. The next thing I wanted to share with you were these um, textured impressions from Sizzix and Hero Arts. Um, here you can see a sneak of the pattern. You get two included, and I just love this um, doily kind of pattern. This one is called Dot Swirl and Medallion Set. So these would be great for Christmas cards. This is the Snowflake Set. So you can run these through your die cutting machine, and then it just gives a really subtle but pretty background. This is Christmas Words and Dots. If you have paper with a white core, you can sand it down and that pattern will shine through. This one is chevrons and flourishes. And this one, it looks like, um, oh, I've grabbed a stamp and emboss set. So this is different than what I've just showed you, but I'll show you this one as well. You stamp the image and then you can also run it through the embosser to have that stamped image raised up. So just another way to make your pattern pop. I also pulled the This and That collection from um, Echo Park. This is the Christmas This and That. They've done This and That for a few different lines and with a lot of vintage imagery and they've always been really popular. So it was fun that they came out with a Christmas version. And I especially love the golds and the warm wood grains in here. I think it just um, has that cozy feeling. And I don't know about you, but a lot of times in my Christmas photos, I have kind of a lot of warm colors come through with my indoor photos. So it's a nice color palette. This is the collection kit where you get um, the different stickers, alphabets, and the elements all in one. And then I also pulled Divine Twine. As this time of year we're, um, we're wrapping up packages and making treats and giving um, cookies and different things like that to our neighbors and friends. So um, stocking up on Divine Twine is um, a good choice. The, it comes with 240 yards or you can also check out other twine in the store um, if you don't want that much. However, I've heard lots of people use over and over the, um, the brown and the oyster, this gray, and I love the oyster. My last pick um, for 5 under 5 is this Himalayan Snowflake Punch from Martha Stewart. It's a nice great big size and um, it's so versatile you can use it year to year. A great tool to add to your stash. Thanks so much for joining me for 5 Under 5, and I'll see you next Tuesday.